the middleweight division is arguably the deepest in the sport. On any given night, any fighter in the top 10 could triumph over another. With some of the sport's biggest stars in the mix at 160 pounds, like Saul Canelo Alvarez and Gennady Golovkin, along with world-class fighters like Demetrius Andrade and Daniel Jacobs, it should come as no surprise that middleweight has garnered a reputation for excitement. Two other top-tier fighters, WBA titleist Robert Brandt and former belt holder Ryota Murata, went to war for the first time in October of 2018. On that night, the heavy underdog Brandt schooled his Japanese counterpart for the title. Now, nine months later, the two are set to throw down again on July 12th in Japan, with the winner launching himself to the upper echelon of the division, while the other is forced back to the drawing board. After earning mandatory challenger status, Brandt's bout with Murata was quickly made, with many expecting the former gold medalist and top-ranked star Murata to easily dispatch a Brandt before moving on to the higher-profile matchups. Brandt had other plans. Light on his feet and throwing well over 1,200 punches, Brandt easily outpointed Murata over 12 rounds, snatching the title from the Japanese sensation and earning himself a seat at the middleweight high table. Riding the momentum, Bravo Brandt jumped back in the ring to defend his new crown four months later. Rob Brandt in front of the home fans, a right hand will end it. Rob Brandt, title defense, check mark. But the plan has always been a rematch with Murata. The former champion is a legit superstar in his native Japan, earning Olympic gold at the 2012 London Games. After losing only once previously in his pro career in a controversial decision to Hassan and Dom, Murata avenged that loss, dominating in his homeland. Brandt welcomes the task, and in front of a pro Murata crowd, Brandt not only expects the best from the former champion, but he wants it. A second win in enemy territory could be the domino that gets things rolling on the path to epic showdowns with the Canelos and Golovkins of the world. Known for accurate shots with both hands, Murata will need to make better use of his technical abilities, relying more on his bicycle to avoid being dragged into an old-fashioned fist fight. But as the proud owner of 11 stoppages, Murata possesses the ability to finish the fight at any moment. Brandt sees himself as a boxer puncher, fundamentally sound, haired with brutal strength. In the duo's first fight, it was Brandt who was the aggressor, pushing the pace, allowing him to run away on the scorecards. Heading into the rematch, as the champion, the 28-year-old's confidence may prove difficult to shake. When these two finally do battle in Osaka, there will be more than just the championship at stake. But the only guarantee is that when these two highly skilled combatants enter the ring, you won't want to miss it.